Hey guys and welcome back to my channel. This is like a two-part clothing haul from Pretty Little Thing. I did a massive order. Actually, it was like a few orders over the past month or so. And I did a going out kind of version with all my outfits for the club, for date night. Now it's gonna be just all the other stuff I got. Some of them definitely could be dressed up to go out. Some of them are like more loungewear. It's just a variety of different things. I love Pretty Little Thing. It's one of my favorite spots to shop on online. I feel like they're on trend. They're always on discount. They have great sizing. I think that's why I always buy from them is because I know my size. It's always true to size. I'm a size US 6, but pretty little thing. Sometimes I'll get a size up, size down, depending on what I want the fit to be, but primarily size 6. And I'll be showing you in this video all bunch of stuff I got. I'll be trying it on, giving you reviews on the sizing, the material, how it fits, how I'm liking it. So if you guys want to see what I got, then definitely keep on watching. So we're gonna start out with these roost leggings. I got them in size four. Like I said, I would usually do size six, but leggings, I always like them to be a little tight, you know, hold everything in. The ruching is on the bum and they are black. I like them because they're double lined, which is really nice. And they fit really, really good. So you can size down if you want. You can stay true to size. I think they'll fit you regardless. But like I said, they're double lined, so they will keep you a little bit warmer and not show anything. You know, they're squat proof, even though I don't think I'd be wearing these in the gym. But I really like them, and I did pair them with this top that I got from Pretty Little Thing. I got it in two colors, because what do they say? When you like something, get it in multiple colors. I got this actually in the petite section. I don't usually shop petite, but I just loved it when I saw it, just the fit of it. It's just like a ribbed sweater, long sleeve, high neck. It does have a kind of curve to the bottom of it. That's what really drew me to it. And like I said, I did get it in black as well. So I will show you that with the next outfit, but I got that and I'm loving it. Both of them, I got them in size four petite. I was a little nervous because I usually do size six and it's a petite size. So I was like, oh, do I want to size down? But the girl, the model in the picture was wearing size like double zero or something. I was like, oh, if she can do it, I could do like two sizes above her. So I got both of those in black and then nude size four, $28. And the ruched leggings, those were size four for $28. Up next is super cash. I actually have been living in these when I'm just chilling at the house. Even if I wanna go out, just run some errands and be super comfortable. I got these like charcoal joggers. They're super known for their joggers, a pretty little thing. I love them, they are big. I got them in size four and they're still pretty big on me. I probably could actually get away with a size two, but $35, like I said, you could dress these up. I've seen girls, you know, rock them in heels. I'm more like white trainers. These, a little crop top maybe if you want to feel like you are kind of showing your waist a little bit more, have a waistline, or you could do oversized tee, whatever you want to do. I paired it, as you'll see in this clip, with this black top. It, I got it in white, it's a cotton funnel neck top. I, I really like the neck to this. When I got it in white though, you could see the kind of lining underneath it, so I did not like the white version, but I stuck with the black version, size six, that was $18, and then the joggers were size four for $35. Up next, I know it's cold right now for some of y'all. I'm in winter right now and I mean, I live in the desert so it's not that cold. I live in Palm Springs, California, but I have been digging biker shorts year around. Maybe can't wear them too late at night, but I think they're so comfortable. You can put an oversized t-shirt on it, just run errands. I would not usually get neon orange biker shorts, but for some reason, the picture on the website the girl was rocking it. I love this outfit together, so I was like, that's cute. You know, I have the black biker shorts. I have like a, a khaki colored, and I was like, why not? Why not just go for it? So I got these orange, like neon orange, so I don't know when I'm gonna wear them again. I think the last time I wore them was like in November, but um, I got those size four, 18 bucks, but the cool thing is they have a lot of different colors. If you do like this disco kind of style to it, they have like a navy blue, so you definitely can choose a different color, but I just love, like I said, how the model was wearing it. She paired it with this t-shirt, just like a graphic tee. The neon shorts, $18 size four, and this tee, it got medium, and it is oversized, and I went with a medium just to kind of stick in the middle, and it was $28. I did like it together. Like I said, maybe not realistic for everybody or every day, but they do have different styles. If you do like the biker shorts, you can do a different color and probably find something that will suit your style. I got this black zipper top. It has the zipper on the top and bottom. It is long sleeve, ribbed material, cotton. It 
fits great. The only thing is I thought that I was gonna really like the unzipped look from the bottom. How you know how all the girls are in the cardigan style where it's like a couple buttons up top and open in the midriff. I was like, ooh, that's cute. I, I don't know if I like it for myself and my body, but I do like the shirt. I probably would use it more looking like a bodysuit kind of tucked in, how you'll see it in this clip maybe if I do it, we'll see. I'll show you like a variety of like how it's styled on the website and how I would maybe wear it. I don't know if I'd do it with these pants, but I just paired it like this for the clip because I also got these leather high-waisted leggings. This is actually the second time I purchased them because they are one of my favorite pieces in my wardrobe. I think this is so sexy. You can wear it with like a white t-shirt and some heels. You can dress it up with a cute like bralette and a blazer. I'm loving this. These are black like faux leather high-waist leggings, size six. The top um, is a medium, $32, and like I said, these are size 6, $28. One of my favorite purchases, hands down these pants. You need them in your life, so you're welcome. Go get them. And then keeping those same pants on, I'm just going to pair it with this blouse. I really didn't know what to do when I got it because when I saw it on the website, the girl just had it how it lays. It's a very low neck, extreme cow neck top in a khaki color. Got size four, $35, and it just it didn't fit right. So I ended up tying it up in like um, a little knot and making it almost like a crop top, but it's still sexy. It's like the material and the color of it, I feel like, I feel like it makes it look very just sophisticated and even though it's tied up and it's a crop top, I still feel like with these leather pants, it's just such a vibe. Some leather little booties, that is my jam. So I love this top. I couldn't rock it. How the website had it as just a full on open top. I tried little bralettes under it, just wasn't my vibe. But when I did it like this, it really worked. So I got this, like I said, size four, $35. I think it's cute. You can dress it up definitely for like a little date night situation. And last, but certainly not least, I've definitely got somewhere out of this, especially with the colder nights here this winter. It is a long, all the way down maxi like coat with a belt on it. Actually, I thought like the belt is what sold me. I was like, oh, I can cinch in my waist, but I like it open. I love it. You can see the outfit underneath it. It was $115, but I did get it during discount. They did a 50% off sale. Pretty little thing is always really good about doing 50% off sale. So I got it in size six. It does have a little button kind of details to it. I like the little sleeve details it has. It has the same as the belt, how you can kind of just tighten the sleeves on your wrist. And it just gives it a little something extra. Like I said, I don't really wear it with the belt as much, but I like it open. I like it closed. They had it in a chocolate brown color and I'm digging it. I've worn so many different outfits underneath it and it's kept me really warm during these winter months. I know that we're kind of like going to be in spring before you know it, but not for all of us, right? So definitely a purchase and definitely something I'll have in my closet for a long time to come. Those are some of my recent pickups from Pretty Little Things. So I hope you're enjoying it. I did do also a uh, like night out clothing haul from them. So I have a whole bunch of other pieces. If you guys want to check that out, definitely click the link below and check out my website and my uh, and check out some of the other videos because I've done clothing hauls with them before. I've done weight loss videos. So depending on what you're into right now, hopefully I can find something that you're going to be into. Make sure you please like and subscribe and I will see you in my next video.